Here with Chris Paul, it's the charity dinner. Beautiful move by Chris Paul. He is quicker than Dawson. DeAndre Jordan. The crowd is going absolutely crazy. Blake Griffin. Oh my! A monster jam! Chris, I do a lot of stuff with uh, inner city kids. What, what do you think, what's the biggest mentor you ever had? Biggest mentor? Yeah, what was the value of mentors for you? Dude, my dad is the greatest mentor I've ever had. I met your mom, she's awesome. How important do you think mentors are for people? Mentors? Yeah. It's very important. Who was Somebody people look up to and run towards. Who was a mentor for you? Uh, you know, I was blessed to have a mentor close to home, my dad, my dad and my brother, so I, I grew up watching them and, and trying to be like them. Thank you so much, man. Yeah. Charlotte's almost as tall. I know. She's super tall. <laughs> DeAndre, I do a lot of stuff with charities. What do you think is the most important thing with finding mentors? Did you have a lot of mentors help you? Uh, coming up, I did, but I never had anything like this to where I could interact yeah. with a lot of the players. Yeah. So I think it's cool for us to be able to get back and have fun like this for now. Like this is cool. Thank you, man. No problem. Look at this guy. He's got Paul Pierce excited. We got Paul Pierce is our wine server. This is crazy, dude. Pierce Make sure you buy some CP wine. CP wine. Make sure you come. <laughs> I'm here with Chris Paul's mother. The power behind it all. What's the secret to raising such a great son? Not just a basketball player, but a nice guy. Spanking him and loving him. <laughs> so I'm here with Chris Paul's father, the original mentor. What would you do to make such a good son? Because your son's not only good at basketball, but he's nice and a good person. I was real strict on him. I'm telling him and his brother both. Really? Very, oh, yes, yeah, very strict. People used to say we was too strict on them, but I mean, with boys, it's different than raising girls. You gotta be a strong character and you gotta let them know that if you're gonna be a man, it's always gonna be much expected of you. Right. And you gotta be strong and you gotta be strong in your beliefs and what you believe in and how you treat people. Yeah. And That's you got a coaching man. background, too. Oh, yeah. You coach the top oh, yeah. kids, AAU. Yes. And you, I mentored them, too. And you beat you 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 won the state championship at my old high school in Low. Yes, in Raleigh, North Carolina. This with normal kids that just believed in what I was doing. You're awesome. I'm so well, glad we you. met you. Well, thank you. Thank, thank you. you. Yeah. Because how important was a mentor in your football oh, career? Big time. Big time. Who's your you favorite know, I was, mentor? I was lucky enough to have a, a father and a mother in the home, and I grew up with a brother. My dad is my hero and still is to this day. But I also had some great coaches and some players that I. When I played football, they came before me, they kind of took me under their wings and showed me the right things and the wrong things to do, so I was lucky that way, and mentors are so important, and I have four kids of my own, so I really try to guide them in the right direction, because they're the ones that's going to lead this country, so you've got to make sure that they have every opportunity to succeed, and so many kids don't nowadays, so many kids are born and live in an environment that they don't have an opportunity to go forward or to succeed. It's over before they start sometimes, and that's, that's a shame. Thank you, man. That's yeah. awesome. Thank you to everyone for being here. Uh, this is an unbelievably humbling experience. We're going to have a lot of fun tonight, as we always do, but it's for a great cause. I guarantee you that. Enjoy, and thank you.